hello and welcome in today's video we are looking at how to make money selling potatoes now we've got three different ways different places we're going to sell potatoes today we're currently down at CDP which is where we were yesterday selling sugar beet but the price where the price is that's where we're going so we jump into the prices now and you can see at the airport it's 1740 and we are at CDP which is 349 so we're not going to get a huge amount for this but we're going to get a lot at the airport I've got a time saving tip which we can use at the airport and also down for selling potatoes at Wandering Grill now the potatoes up in the airport and wandering grill you have to sell in pallets so we go and do that and we did it with sugar beet yesterday and it was is a bit tedious uh, loading and unloading pallets so so let's offload this one and the price was at what did we say it was three four nine and this is forty thousand liters and I've got two more trucks with the same amount in each. 13,968. Okay, not bad, I suppose. But we want to make some proper money. So now we're going to go down to Wandering Grill, which is just round the corner. Hopefully they haven't gone home because their timing has been a bit strange over here, down here at the moment. Right, so what I've got hooked up is one of the pallet trailers, trailers, conveyors. This this machine actually converts it into pallets. So I've filled it up and I, what I've done is I've, you've set it, let's lock that, have a look behind. So the rear conveyor, let's have a look here, is lined up with the cell point just there. So we need, let's put on the help menu a minute. Lower belt, enable pallet creation. And there it is pallet pops out and it keeps filling up but also if you check the money out now the money's going down so it will continuously sell as long as you keep the conveyor topped up and this conveyor takes in 16,000 so you see look at that it's going in lovely it, it's just filling up and emptying at the same time so I've also got the rest of the 40,000 litres you can see there's 24,000 in there be careful not to push the conveyor like I just did the shoe and tip we'll just tip there it's good. it goes in it's these mods I'm using this man hook lift nice bit of kit this is lovely I love it, it just ha hasn't got a trailer attachment you just can't fit trailers to it so it is well what's the point so we can leave that run in there let's take off that help window Right, and that's that finished, and that's 53,490, which is not a bad payday. Now, if you had a bigger trailer, you can just keep loading into here, and it as long as you, you don't stop the stream 
of potatoes running in and running out then the price will stay the same now I'd imagine yeah there it is the price has dropped down 782 now but the price at the airport still is 1740 so that is the next place we are going because I tried to do the same at the airport now at the airport your sell point is actually at the uh, in the back of the helicopter so it's a bit hard to get that conveyor in the back of there uh, with pallets so I was like so what I tried messing around with is I started the pallet machine off but put a little little bit oh, half the pallet full up and then the aim was I was going to place the pallet on the ramp of the helicopter and then convey uh, potatoes in off from straight out of the back of the truck so when I was doing that I found because you're using conveyors I think well you are tricking the system at the end of the day because it oh we don't want to get stuck down there because it's pouring in and pouring out so as long as you're bringing an item what pours in and pours out it's going to do it continuously now we are struggling up here 13 mile an hour 12 back up to speed so to make it all all of that to make sense of it all all you have to do is bring a truck up to here Now, have you noticed we've got no pallet machine here because you don't need to all you do is set up the conveyor so it's in the back and make sure it's actually in the cell point there get in start that up get in our other truck here and all you've got to do is dump it out on the ground and that conveyor picks it up anyway and as you can see it just because it recognises it doesn't recognise the pallets but it recognises it pouring in so it works and you see the money's going up a treat and at 1740 well I have got I think there was 400,000 potato it's, it's, you, all you, you need to do is keep adding to this pile to get rid of it all so you've even got enough time to go and get another truck come back and keep piling it in there because the money's going up but the last well the last one took five minutes so I think we will leave it there okay so it missed a little bit there but that was 52,000 so you have got to be careful with these conveyors because for some reason it hasn't picked that up it might be just because the truck is on it yes see it was it was just because the truck was on it it stopped it and now the price has probably dropped yes well it's still a thousand so we may as well uh, let him pick that up and that's that that was another ten thousand yes yeah, so that was worth picking up uh, you see the price of that, yep, it's 1047 and see Wandering Girl is still at 785 and compared to all the others, Potatoes is quite a good money spinner anyway. We go into the harvest income and so that was selling 120,000 litres of sugarcane sugarcane potatoes 120,000 litres and up just over a thousand each average average out so not bad 130 grand 
So remember, with your potatoes, don't sell them loose. Sell them, well, you don't have to sell them in pallets. All you need to do is bring your conveyor up to here and unload jobs are good in. Now you can also do this with sugar uh, beet as well. Um, you can probably do this at Wandering Grill, but it's just as easy to do it with the conveyor. Okay, so if you like what you see, hit that subscribe button and don't forget to give us a like if you enjoyed the video and I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching.